Guys, I have had Sims 4 custom content removed completely from my game for a few weeks now. There were a bunch of bugs and glitches and it was a whole thing. And now look at the absolute carnage that has taken over my game. I mean, this is just unacceptable. So today we're going to go CC shopping for The Sims 4. I'll show you where to find Sims 4 custom content, where I frequent the most often for CC. And then later we'll do a try on haul for everything that we downloaded today. I am planning on doing a Bratz create a sim video at some point. So a lot of this stuff will be inspired by Bratz dolls. I'll also have all of the links for the custom content that we do download today in the description down below. So the first thing that I do when I'm looking to download Sims 4 custom content is I come onto Pinterest. I literally just look up Sims 4 CC. Right off the bat, I found this post and this person laid out every single hair and the links that we need to download right down here at the bottom. I think these braids down here are so cute. I also like this flippy hairstyle. So I'm just gonna open up those links. A lot of the times that'll bring you to a Patreon on page of the creator who made what you're looking for. And this is where we go down the rabbit hole. This one is cute because it looks like we have different variations. Like there are different lengths. I like how some of them have the braids behind and some of them are in front. I'm gonna download like a lot of versions of this. Then I basically just check out their entire Patreon page. Like we're gonna scroll, we're just gonna download any cute hairs we see. And then other times you'll be sent to the Sims resource. And then the same thing, we find one thing that we we like and then we just stock their entire page. I also found this little collage of cute hairs. They also have the download links down here. So we're going to download this one, which is by Enrique S4. I'm gonna download this one with a swoopy bang. Oh my gosh, how good is this? I've never seen this creator before. This is by Gloomy Geek. So we're gonna download this hair, but they have some other really good ones. Like look at these hairs. We're gonna download those too. And this one with the bandana. Okay, I'm just gonna link their entire Patreon. <laughs> they also created this hair with the little pigtails down at the front and they really only have a few posts. So yeah, I'm gonna link their entire Patreon. I'm downloading everything. <laughs> this is another one where they just post a bunch of their favorite hairs and all of the links to them. I'm definitely getting this one. This is so pretty. Another place that I come to check out a lot for hair is Daylife Sims. They have this new Dove Cameron set. I'm totally gonna be downloading those braids. This is so cute too with the little bow in the back. Also, they nailed the creation of that sim. I've downloaded a lot from this creator and I know that their hairs turn out so good in game. They are serving you with an entire Britney set. <laughs> Iconic. This is everything. As someone who spent my youth dancing around the living room to, oops, I did it again. I feel like it's my responsibility to download this. This is another one I found, a 70s hair set. Look at this. This could be such a cute jade updo. I think there are different versions of it with the strands hanging down. I've never downloaded from this creator though, so we'll see how this looks in game. Another one from Daylife Sims. How adorable is this with the flowers in the hair? We're getting it. One thing about me, I could download hairs for The Sims 4 like all day long. <laughs> it's my favorite thing to download, but we're gonna move on. Let's start looking at some clothes. This one was the first thing that popped up and I know this creator. We're going straight to their Patreon. This is Madeline. And here is the set that I was looking at. This is so cute. It comes in a bunch of different colors. But I haven't been here in a while, so let's keep looking and see what we get. I know I have a lot of shoes by them. Like, these are super cute. And if I'm thinking of doing brat stall, this could be giving brat stall. Also, these boots are calling my name. They come with or without the sock. And I'm also looking at this Ugg-inspired boot collection. They come in short versions. There's a tall version. There's one with a sock. There are different swatches too. Oh, they even have the Ugg slippers. I feel like this set could turn out really nice in game. I'm gonna try it. I need this dress with those glasses. And these diva boots, like they look chunky. This is what I need. Look at those in pink. We have an entire goth inspired collection. I'm going to be downloading some of this stuff. Oh, this stuff is cute too. Okay, I think I need to move on from this one, <laughs> this one Patreon. But I feel like they've got something for everyone like look at these glittery boots and i'm supposed to say no and this bunny backpack these come for children and toddlers we're getting it there's a dog version
version two. We're getting all of them. I literally never ever have children or toddlers in my game. Okay, final thing I'm getting from this creator are these cat glasses. If I'm gonna be creating Jade, I gotta get her these glasses. They're perfect. Okay, another random thing I found, these sneakers. They come in a bunch of different swatches. These are by Blue Craving. I also really like these. I've downloaded from this creator before too. This is by Gia Sims and they've got a bunch of different sneakers I'm gonna download. These are the ones that caught my eye. I just found these little heart platform boots. I feel like I've already downloaded a ton of shoes today, but Gia Sims is so good when it comes to shoes. Like look at those slides. I don't even know 100% if I like these, but I need them. I found this creator. This is by Miss Valentine. I've never downloaded from them before, but this one caught my eye. I think that might be a purse going behind and I love giving my Sims purses. Oh no, maybe it's not a purse. Maybe it's just a strap. Oh, well, I already downloaded it. We'll figure it out. From this same creator, I'm also downloading this one. You guys, this is a backpack with crystals hanging out of the pocket in the back. This is so good for occult sims, especially with the crystal creation stuff pack. Obsessed with these moon tights. Another place I love to frequent, although I'm pretty sure I've caught up on all of their custom content because I come here so often, is Aretha B. They've got this Taylor Swift sim for download. I actually downloaded this Taylor Swift hair not too long ago. I don't know if I ever did try it on though. So let's just get it again so I can show you. Actually, this outfit is adorable and her sims are so cute. Let's get this outfit as well. Another one I come to check out a lot is called Rimmings. Their stuff can be a lot more alpha. I tend to have more of a Maxis Match style in The Sims 4, but I have found a lot of my favorite pieces from this creator. Like this stuff is cute. I think I'm gonna get a couple of the shirts. Look at this crochet strawberry outfit. I don't know why I'm gonna be using this, but I will be using it. We're getting both, obviously. This creator makes some of my favorite hairs as well. This is from Kamiri. I love this Pisces hair. Tell me they didn't make an entire Zodiac collection. I am about to download every single one. Okay, no, they only ended up doing the Aquarius and the Pisces one, but I love it. There's also this one I'm gonna download and also they make the coolest Sims. Like she is so cool. And okay, I think we're ready to move on from clothes because Twisted Cat, who I talk about in every single Create a Sim video, has put out some new 3D lashes and you know we're downloading these. There's also a new skin with freckles. We're doing it. I don't think I've downloaded these eyes yet, so I'm gonna get those too. This creator also puts out some really cute hairs. I don't have this one. They've got makeup. Look at this hair. Yeah, this is another creator where I can just confidently download everything because I know it's gonna turn out good. I found this really interesting makeup page called Cosmetic. I'm mostly interested in these lashes because they kind of look doll-like, like those painted on ones. And if I'm gonna be going for brat stall, I feel like I could pull this off. And also their makeup is gorgeous. I'm gonna download this eyeshadow. I'm gonna download a bunch of stuff. I'm intrigued. I found this jaw contour. This is by Lady Simmer. All right, final things we're getting. I feel like I've downloaded so much. We are getting this star bag from Lumi Sims. This top set also from Lumi Sims. We're getting this skirt set, which apparently has like 120 swatches. Oh my God, this moon bag. Tell me this is not just for kids and toddlers. No. Okay, there's an adult version. Phew, we're getting that for sure. And we're getting this bikini and cover up. And this is the final thing, I swear. No, it's not. I am on a constant hamster wheel of CC shopping. It's a real problem. So I came back. You guys, I'm so addicted to CC shopping for The Sims 4. I can't help it. But I found this entire collection inspired by brats. I could not pass this up. This is created by Green Llamas and I'll link this down below as well. These are actually the last things I downloaded today though, I promise. Okay, let's see how everything we downloaded for The Sims 4 now looks in game. We're already wearing one of the new hairs that we downloaded. This was one of the first ones with all the different versions. Okay, so this is the new skin that I got from Twisted Cat and the way that it changes the face is crazy. This is without, this is with the skin detail and this is just the default. So there are different versions in here. I remember the first time I downloaded a Twisted Cat skin detail, I was a little 
little bit like shocked at first, kind of like I am now, but then it grows on you. Like I feel like it changed my entire face shape completely, but she still looks really cute, I think. There are also some freckles that I downloaded. This is how it looks with some of those on there. And there are a ton of different options. They come in different swatches too. So some of them are lighter. Some of them show up darker on the face. Here is the jaw contour that I downloaded. Again, there are different swatches so you can adjust how dark or light you want it to appear. I'm undecided on this one. I can't tell if I like it or not. I also downloaded something from Twisted Cat that changes the eye shape. I don't know if I'm being dramatic, but I feel like that is a very big change as well. I think the eyes that I downloaded might go on as a default, which I don't like. I'll probably be taking that off, but there is a heterochromia option. And let me see the lashes. I think these are the new ones. And yeah, these are so cute. I'm in love with these. So let's check out some of the hairs that we got. I downloaded a lot of them by accident. Just kidding, it was on purpose. Okay, let's check out the Gloomy Geek ones. These are the ones that I had never tried before. This is a bandana one. Okay, this is cute. I feel like I can change the color of the bandana somewhere probably. Okay, yeah, here's the bandana we can change. So tons of different swatches for that, which I like. Here's the swoopy hair, which is so good. I really like how the swatches look. It's super long in the back too. This one's cute with the little curly pieces at the front. We've got this one with the curly bangs at the front. I love the little pigtails too. Oh, look at the buns. And the one with like the third bun. I make a lot of weird occult sims and I feel like this could work for like an alien sim. I'm here for it. Next, we have this one. I believe this one was from Enrique Sims 4. Obsessed. Same as this one with like the longer braids. This one with the bangs. Oh, I love this one too with that little piece coming down at the front. And now we're getting into some of the day life sims ones these are the ones that i told you guys i knew it would look good i definitely have this one in my game already i might have downloaded some duplicates but this one has like a little bobby pin in the back oh my gosh how cute is this one this is the one i think that came with the flowers in the hair hold on let me find it yup this one is so good and we have this one with the braids the 70s hair is perfect and she is slaying this blue color we got so many hairs i'm sorry i couldn't help it look at this ponytail and we've got the britney one so adorable i don't know if i really will use these britney hairs i kind of just wanted to see them like in my game this one i'll probably use though this one is pretty like generic we've got this one here by twisted cat the side pony one here also from twisted cat the flippy one actually surprised me in a good way this is by sim celebrity and then we've also got the kamiri ones the this is the one with the side pony. Now that I see this one, I feel like I already had this one in my game, but here's how it looks. We also have this really cute side one and we have the Taylor Swift ones from Aretha B. I love how the bangs shape her face. These are again, all of the braid ones. I love with the pieces at the front. And here is the one by Josh CO. Might be mispronouncing that, but here it is. I love it with the buns there. We got some really good hairs today. There were also some of the fun glasses that we got. These were the heart ones and we have the cat ones. These are so cute. Oh yeah, we also got all those weird lashes. Okay, let me remove the ones that I'm wearing and I'll move that hair back. Okay, so these are the lashes. It's technically just an eyeliner, so they're not the 3D, they're only 2D. I don't think I'm gonna use these all that often, but for the purposes of what I was talking about with like the doll look, I might be able to get away with these. These are the eyeshadows that I got. And then we have some of the Twisted Cat lips and you just cannot go wrong with these. These are perfect. Like this gloss look is so nice. I'm definitely going to be using those a lot. At some point, I got a random flower crown and all of the accessories for like some of the braids and things that I downloaded are here. Plus, I didn't know this, but the skirt and belt combination I downloaded earlier are separate. So I can change the color of the belt here. Okay, now for clothes. Let's start out with the full body outfits. This is the one that I thought had a purse and it doesn't. It's just like a strap. Hold on, let me get some shoes. Let me just wear these Converse for now. This is one of the other outfits I downloaded from that same creator. This one's cute. Oh, I really like the swimsuit cover up we got. That is adorable with the heart. This is one of the sets we downloaded from Madeline. I feel like this is kind of just like a lounge chill set around the house, maybe like PJs. We have the Aretha B T Swift outfit. Some super cute swatches in here. We've got some of the more alternative 
good looks. These are from Madeline. I feel like my purse is looking a little wonky on here, but I do like the fit. This is one of the dresses that we got. Again, comes with or without the purse. And this is another set that I also got from Madeline. I'm really loving the green. Let's go see now for shirts and bottoms. I'm gonna pair everything just with this Rimmings jeans skirt that we downloaded. So here's one of the tops. Again, this comes with so many different swatches of like patterns. There are also so much just plain colors. This is giving like Y2K a little. I think this tank top is like same thing, just a bunch of different patterns on it. This halter is from one of the sets from Madeline. We've got this top with the sleeves. Oh, the strawberry set. Okay, we're gonna come back to that because I need to see the full thing. Oh, this jacket ended up cute. I love the little teddy bear detail on it. This one also came in a set with like matching pants. The pink is so pretty. I have a super basic top here, which I feel like goes under another thing. We've got this top here from Rimmings, a short sleeve like corset style top. Oh, this one looks so cute too with like the knit going over top. Okay, let me get that strawberry shirt back on. I need to see at the bottoms. This is so adorable. Here is that full set again with the pants we downloaded. I also got this skirt with like a star on it. Not sure how I feel. This is one of the skirts that we got. This is the one with like a million different swatches in it and the matching belt that you can change the color of. So here is that matching skirt. Okay. Yeah, super into this set. It also came with some pants. I have these pants here that I downloaded from Madeline and I'm definitely a huge fan of the skirt we got. Oh yeah, all of the purses and bags we got. So here is the backpack that we downloaded with like the crystals hanging out the back. I will totally be using this for my cult sims. And then that star purse that we got comes in two different forms. There's one where she's holding it or there's one that kind of goes around, but sometimes they look a little weird. Like you have to adjust the sims body like just to make it work. But for this moon bag, I might have to make an exception. We also have those moon tights there. Those are pretty cool. I'm trying to like style them as we go so they don't look super crazy. <laughs> but they also come in lighter swatches and they also come without the moons. Oh, and we got these socks with like the ripped fishnet stockings too. Let's check out the shoes. So here are the Uggs and with this outfit, that is a moment. Here they are with the longer version and we have the version with the socks, love. Let me see the glittery boots. <laughs> these are everything. These I could totally use for brats. These are the other boots that we got. I like how these ones always change the height. Again, you guys saw the Converse. They come in a bunch of different colors. Here are the shoes that we got with the little flower things on them. They look so cute with this outfit. This is a version with socks. Did not know that I got these and they only come in one cheese swatch. Here are some of the chunkier shoes. Again, in a bunch of different swatches. We got these runners here. Some super cute colors with these. And these are the chunky boots that we got from Gia Sims. And I also wanted to go back and show you some of the last minute haul items I got because these were also super pretty and totally matched the aesthetic that I was looking for. And I think that's about it. So once again, the links will be in the description of this video if you guys want to go and download them. If there's something that I missed, let me know and I'll try and find it. And if you're looking for other custom content that you've seen in my other Sims 4 videos, I have an ultimate CC list video where I link pretty much all of my favorites. So I'll link that down below as well. And if you guys like the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.